Hi Queens. Thank you for stopping by Currency Queen Budgets. My name is Kanisha. I am a single mother of four. On this channel, I do all things budgets, playing with me's, DIYs, and lifestyles. This video, I will be cash stuffing a total of $452. If that is something you're interested in, stay tuned. Let's get to it. All right, so this is my money bag. You can find this on my Etsy store. And I think I am almost sold out um, because they have really been selling and I haven't reordered any supplies. So yeah, so let's count this money. Let's get it straight first. How has everybody been doing? I hope y'all been doing great. Had a great week. And getting ready for the new year. I hope y'all set y'all goals for 2023 too. I know y'all did. If y'all didn't and y'all don't know how to set goals, y'all, I'm going to link that video right up here. Go check that out on how to set your goals, y'all, because we need to set goals. Um, But let's count this money here. So I have 100, 200, 250, 300. 20, 40, 60, 80, 400. 10, 20, 30. That's 430. 35, 40, 45. 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, and 52. And guys, I really didn't. I really just grabbed some denominations out the bank. I really don't have anything to stuff, but my variable expenses and my credit card and the rest i guess we will see what we'll do with that later so um just to forewarn you guys um i'm not fully prepared so for my credit cards i think i want to stuff 100 dollars in here and i'm just going to take a 100 dollar bill So that is $265. Um, Tides. Ooh, I can put something in Tides. Let's throw, um, So I'll come back to that. Okay. So that is it for my bills binder. And we are going to do our variable expenses next. And y'all, when I say I still have money left over because I had so many no spend days. I was determined to um, not spend anything if I didn't have to. So in groceries, I have left over 20, 40, 60, 65, 66, 67, and 68. I'm still going to add is normal $100 here. And we are going to stuff that. And I don't know, I cannot spend these $1 bills. But those might go into my $1 savings challenges for next month. So I will put those in my savings challenge binder. Um, For gas, what do I have left over? 20, 40, 60, 65. And y'all, I have not been going anywhere. If it's not needed, I just go straight to work and back. I haven't had to stop to pick up my daughter. Um after school so i just go to work and come right back 
if I need to go to the store, it's probably in between, you know, on my lunch break or something. I'll run to the store or I'll set a quick pickup right after work on the way home. So, yeah, I haven't been doing anything, anything at all. So, my gas is going to be at 75, the normal 75. So now I have 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 35, 140. 140 in gas. Yay for gas. I should have used that as some rollover money, y'all. I really should have. And I could have took some of the extra money out and paid down on a credit card. Because y'all know my motto is debt free 2023. And I'm trying to get all these credit cards paid off as much as I can. Like, I ain't got no more time for 2022. <laughs> I'm out. Out of time. So for eating out, I'm uh, let's do a 20 for eating out. But yeah, so if y'all come back on this and see that my envelopes are empty, y'all, I probably just unstuffed them and used that extra cash. But um, I don't know. I don't know what I want to do. But I'm going to leave it there for right now. So, household will get 20. And I have 20, 40, and 60. So, I'm sure I haven't been going nowhere, y'all. I haven't been going nowhere. I haven't been buying anything. Nothing. Um, Because around Christmas, y'all, it was cold. It snowed here. It sleeted. I stayed in the house when it's cold, when it's freezing cold, y'all. I don't want to go nowhere. I don't even want to go to work half the time because it's cold outside. <laughs> okay, for spending, I have 26. And spending is going to get a 10. I did send my son to get me a um, Coke and some chocolate one day. Because he came home from work. And I just sent him right back out to the store. Because I didn't want to go to the store. But, Yeah. Okay, and for medications, I'm going to do 10. I have $10 already in here. And then for deposit, this is going to go into my credit card. I have, I went to the gas and got gas station. I went to the gas and got gas station. I went to the gas station and got gas. And it was um, $29. Was it 29 or 31 I think it was 29 No, it was not. I have $35 here. It was 33 So I just did 35 because I didn't have any ones. And then this is... Um, what is this for? I don't know. But I had it to be deposited. But I'm going to add this to my credit card folder. And that's it for my variable expenses, y'all. That was $235 in my variable expenses. So, uh, credit card. So that's just to pay back my gas tab. Because I'm going to tell y'all what I did. For some of you that may be wondering why I am doing it like that. So what I did is um, last week when I got gas, I used my credit card. And the reason why I use my credit card is because I, I want to accumulate the rewards points that comes with credit card and, you know, using them at certain gas stations. So I actually used my credit card and then I took out the money and put it into that deposit envelope. So I would know to go and deposit that, but I guess I still forgot to go deposit it because it was still there. 
but that is all and let's see what we have left over so I have 50 70 90 100 5 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 and 17 so that's $117 um, I'm not sure what I want to do with it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hold on to it because I don't know what I want to do with this yet. So I'm going to like this here and oh, this here is my K-Bucks, y'all. My K-Bucks that I pulled out of my ones that I saved for the whole year. If you did not see that video and you are interested in seeing how many ones are actually in that envelope, actually you can um, go up here. I will have it, the, the link to the video up here. But yeah, I just stuffed them all in this A5 envelope, y'all. So now y'all see why I'm fooling with A5 right now. Look. So I have to. I'm going to take that to the bank um, tomorrow, I guess, because I actually went to the bank and I didn't think to take that with me because I went to the bank on the way home. So I'm going to actually slide this back in here for right now. Um, but guys, that is it for this video. I will actually do another video and do my month ahead. Um, so y'all be on the lookout for that, but I really appreciate you guys for stopping by. I hope that you hit that like and subscribe button, hit that notification bell. So you are notified every time I upload content and leave me a comment in the next video. I will be stuffing my month ahead binder. So if that is something you're interested in, I hope you roll on over there and watch that video as well. I'm gonna get off here because I want to keep this video under 15 minutes. So, um, Y'all know it. Y'all have a great new year. And be blessed, Queenies. Bye.